Good evening and welcome back once again. If you watched the last episode we had a very convincing 5-0 win and today we've got the second leg against Brentford in the semi-final. I believe the first leg was 2-0 to ourselves so we've got a fairly comfortable cushion um, going into this second leg. I just wanted to touch on something before I start this match actually, just some plans for the future. So I'm really enjoying playing pair 6, the Master League career mode and um, as of this moment, I'm actually recording this on Christmas Eve. Um, but I've actually bought PES 2021 um, for the PlayStation. Now, I do most of my recordings on the PC, and I got managed to get PES 6 for the PC, and obviously the option files, as you can see, and all of that. The trouble is, is it's pretty janky on the PC itself. Um, Yes, the game is old, but also just the version of it that I've got on the PC. It it is very prone to like slowing down and stuttering. It doesn't look as bad in the recording in the actual video, but actually playing it can sometimes be a bit of a pain. So I did want to try a, a sort of a modern version of of PES again. Um, so I've bought PES twenty one, two thousand twenty one rather. And I've seen some really good option files from Pez Universe, who always do a fantastic job. So when I do get it delivered, it should be shortly the game. I'm going to get all of the option files sorted. And at some point, I will start a Master League career mode in that game and upload it to the channel. Now, that doesn't mean Pez 6 is going to stop at the moment. I'm definitely going to finish this season in Pez 6, that's for certain. I'm already well ahead of... Um, you know, I've already recorded a lot of this. Um, you know, like I say, as of recording, this is Christmas Eve. This probably won't come out until well into January. I'm quite a, quite a way ahead in terms of videos. So it was just to give you guys a bit of an update that I will be starting a PES 2021 career mode. I haven't decided what team I'm going to play as, but I do know I'm going to start with the default players. Sorry, the original players, which is doesn't matter what team you start with you start with these um made up you know very poor players um you know i'm sure you guys that have played pez before will know of that it's it's what most people do and this career mode on pez 6 i didn't do that simply because it was an up-to-date option file i was playing as newcastle and i wanted to play with the newcastle squad that is in real life um but in pez 2021 Whatever team I'm going to decide on playing as, I am going to start with the um, the default um, players and work my way up. So it's going to be a longer series. I'm going to have to start from scratch and build that team up slowly. And I thought that would be really interesting. And that's normally the way I would play Pez, to be honest, rather than starting with the actual real players. So keep an eye out for that. Pez 6 will continue. Like I say, I'll, I'll definitely finish this season off whether we continue on for another season, I'm not sure. Um, but let's just jump into this match today. So this is going to be the lineup for today. I am bringing Jamal Lewis in for Davies. And I'm also bringing Joel Linton in for Bellingham. Uh, the rest of the players are pretty much the standard starting eleven we would pick. So we'll just jump in, see how we get on in the first half. Yeah, so I hope you guys, you know, that I, I know I don't get a massive amount of views on this, but I, I really love doing it. Oop, hang on. Could be an early year. Oh, good tackle. Um, yeah, and I do appreciate, you know, the people that do watch it on a regular basis or even just pop in now and again. You know, we have got some regulars that seem to watch uh, most, if not all, of the videos, and I really do appreciate it. So, you know, I hope you guys will continue on this journey when we do start on PES 2021. Um, I just think it's time I do a, a modern one again. Oh, yeah. oh, nearly. oh, that's a foul. Terrible tackle there. On target, not enough power though. Yeah, it's, it's such a shame. I mean, if I could play, if I could get a version of PES 6 on the PlayStation with an up-to-date option file, that'd be great. But, you know, you can't, 
Um, I would have to get, you know, you can't do that on the PS5. I'd have to get like an old PlayStation 3 or something, a PlayStation 2 or, or something like that. Um, and I don't even know if you can get option files for that. But it is a bit janky, it's a bit old, and it, it's even more so on the PC itself. But I've had a, a lovely time playing it. Um, really enjoyed playing this new castle boat with an, an up to date option file, all the squads and everything. I need to concentrate on this game a bit. I think. Good ball into the owl. There's not really many people in the box. By the time there was, there was plenty of defenders to uh, cut that out. That's a corner. Bit of a slow start in this one. Probably because I'm talking too much. Oh, that's... What? What? What happened there? That was not a foul. I have absolutely no idea what happened there. And there it is. 1-0. Isaac in there. Well, that was deserved because I have no idea what happened in that term. Um, I disallow goal. I mean, it's very scrappy. But 1 0, we're off the mark. Like I say, the, uh, I haven't even got the 2021 game yet. I've ordered it. Um, And then I'll need to start. I've, I've seen that, you know, Pez Universe are still doing option files for 2021 with the updated squads for 2022-23, which looks great. I don't exactly know fully what teams are going to be in it. Oh, hang on. Oh, nearly, nearly two. Good save from the keeper. And the defender managed to cut it out. The rebound. Stephen Rice, ah, straight at the keeper. But yeah, I don't fully know what leagues and teams are in there. Obviously, you're going to have the usual, like, Premier League, Spanish League, etc. But I kind of want to try something different. You know, I would love to play as Newcastle again, but I'm not going to do that. Holy out. Joel Linton, ah. Couldn't get out from underneath my feet. Maybe could have taken a second touch there. Nice ball. That's a poor header. Well won back though. It's a little bit scrappy. But um, I'm keeping the pressure on mostly. Now, I guess that's why he's got a little bit of space. That's not the best of balls. Oh, well cut out there. Thought St. Maximum might have been in on the left. That's good. Isaac, ah, good goalkeeping. Maybe one last chance here. Oh, it's a crossbar. Oh. And that's half time. Oh. Well, we'll jump into the second half, but good finish to the second half there.
so yeah, so anyone watching this, I would really appreciate um who would you like me to see play as in 2021? That's obviously assuming that the team you mentioned is available. Um ideally not a Premier League team. If we could go for Spanish, Italian, a different league. I don't know if they've got Mexican leagues, if they've got South American leagues in there or not. But something maybe a little bit different. Oh nearly. Good corner there. Ideally, I would like a European team, um, just because then you can play like Champions League or whatever the equivalent is in that game. Um, Isaac was away there. Just seemed to get pulled back a bit. Could be in here. There's a corner. Take it quickly because there's a little bit of space in the box there. That's a cool one. Make some changes that in the next little break, I think. Got a bit unlucky with a the bounce there. That's uh, not where I was intending to play it. But what we'll do is we'll make some changes now. Okay, so I'm going to push St. Maximin up top. I'm going to bring on Almiron on the right for Brian Hill. I'm going to put on Rayner on the left. And bring on Bruno Gomeresh for Joe Linton. So we're pretty much changing the, the uh, all of the attack midfielders around there. Good idea, just poorly executed that last pass. Um, the 1 2 was on. Good tackle. Can we get it back? No. Nice tackle. It doesn't break kindly. It's been happening that this half, getting the tackles in and not getting some of the, the luck. Like that. What happened there? Yeah, I can feel. I can feel the, the the momentum swinging, as in the computer wants uh, wants certain things to happen. You know, you, you can just tell sometimes. Um, need that second goal, really do. Should have scored there. I know the pressure was on from the defender, but got to be hitting the target. Nah. But yeah, going back to 2020, PES 2021, when I start that massive career, ideally it would be in a top league, but with a, you know, one of the smaller clubs. So maybe like a, a Spanish team, Italian team, German team, something that's, but not, well, not one of the top teams. Um, you know, we can build that team up slowly, um, get some youngsters and things like that. That would be one of those ones where it's a little bit of a struggle for a couple of se seasons. Um, not taking any chances there. Yeah, me, talk me talking whilst playing is uh, probably not a good idea. Um, I know I do that in general, 
but it's more about the actual game itself. Um, oh, St. Maxon's in here. Lovely little pass. Should have scored though. Really should have scored there. Lovely pass to him, and he was he was in on goal. Could he have taken it a little bit further? Um, not sure. Surely that was out, wasn't it? That looked miles out. I have no idea what's going on there. Ah, oh, it's a shocking pass from St. Maximum. Good tackle, but again, we're not really getting the lock. Those bounces. Lovely clearance though. And that's actually turned out to be quite a nice ball to set maximum. Oh come on, you don't just stop running. Whoop, the keeper's dropped it. What happened there? I haven't actually seen that before. Look that he had it. Um there it is, full time. Not the best of games. I should have done a lot better than that. I mean that was not a one nil game. It dominated the game there. And Isaac with man of the match, not a surprise considering he got the only goal. But the ratings are not not the best, to be honest. But that'll do it for this week. We're through to the final of the cup. Got a very comfortable 3 0 aggregate win there. And if we just have a look at the calendar, well, there's not that many matches left. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six matches in the league, and then we've got the final as well. So only seven matches this season. Then we'll have to see whether we're going to continue on or whether we'll just jump straight into PES 2021 after this season's ended. But thank you very much for joining once again. Please leave your comments down below about your thoughts about what team to play as in, in my next career mode and any other feedback you've got. But I really appreciate you guys watching. So hopefully I'll see you next time. Speak to you soon.